It's a mass few could even imagine before the pandemic held feet from the front doors of St. Patrick Cathedral in the church parking lot. But it was the only way churches could have services this morning. Thanks for joining us. I'm Phil Orban and I'm Genevieve Curtis. Churches won't be able to have indoor services until phase two of the reopening. Channel 9's Deshaun Brown was at this morning's very unique service. Deshaun, inside or outside, parishioners were really just happy to be back. Genevieve, yeah, I mean, the way that this church is set up and where it's located, it's not really built to accommodate drive in services. So this was really the first time that people could worship together here in person in months. Like I think the past six weeks or so remind you how important community is at a time where there is so much focus on maintaining distance. It could not have been a more perfect day. This is a moment to come together. It's the first mass in practically two months that we've been able to attend. Now that North Carolina entered phase one of a gradual process to reopen the state, that also means houses of worship can hold service in person, only this time in an open space outdoors. This week, Governor Roy Cooper said the science shows the risk of transmitting the virus indoors is much higher. The state order still asks that families stay at least six feet apart and wear a mask. Well, it was creative, that's for sure. Um, it was also uh, special in a way because people made an extra effort. And we were kind of afraid that, uh, that the government might go a little too overboard and extend the, the lockdown or whatever so long that we wouldn't know when we would see mass again. I mean, for Catholic, uh, worship without a mass is not worship at all. God is good, all and all the times. St. Patrick's Catholic Church also observing communion. The priests sanitize their hands after serving each family, and instead of forming a line, they served one family at a time. I have been fortunate to go to mass at places all over the world, in many countries, in many places, and I've seen a, a lot of variety, but uh, not quite like this. And today was also or is also Mother's Day. So to honor that, they took donations for Women's Shelter Miravia, and that money will go toward helping pregnant women and new mothers who need it. Genevieve. I'm sure it was nice just to all be back together again, and they certainly had a perfect day for it. Deshaun, thank you.